here in all my bare-faced glory to tell you about my current skincare routine with Kiehl's and more specifically my morning skincare routine. So let's just get straight into it. So first of all, I always start with an oil-based cleanser. I always like to double cleanse. I find that it makes my skin feel clean and makes sure that I've got all the dirt and debris off my skin. And I think it's just a great habit to have. So I go in with my oil-based cleanser first and it also takes, if there's any little bits of makeup left that didn't come off the night before or anything like that, it takes it all off. After that, I pop my gel cleanser on and I've been using my Clarisonic Mia 2, which I love. Beauty Bulletin kindly sent me one and I am obsessed. So basically a Clarisonic is a cleansing tool. Um, it doesn't spin, so it doesn't stretch the skin, it oscillates. Um, it's a self-timed tool as well, which is great. Basically, you do 20 seconds on your forehead, you do 20 seconds on your nose and chin area, and then 10 seconds on each cheek. There are also two speeds, which is great. So if you have a more sensitive skin like I do, I started out on the lowest speed, and then I sort of use it for one week on the lower speed and then the next week I put it up to the second speed. I do find that I can't use it twice a day, it makes my skin just a little bit sensitive, so I use it once a day, but I have seen a huge improvement um, in just the clarity of my skin almost. I feel like my skin is a lot more cleansed and a lot more deeply cleansed after I've used it. So after I've cleansed my skin and I've patted it dry with a towel, I start going in with all the bits and pieces that Kiehl's sent me. So the first one I go in with is the creamy eye treatment with avocado. Now this is quite a thick eye cream, so you really need a tiny little pit, like smaller than a pea size. Um, I pop a little bit on my finger, I rub it between my two middle fingers, and then I gently dab it on. So you want to make sure that you don't rub your eye cream on. Your under eye area is so sensitive that you don't want to pull and tug at that skin. I take my eye cream all the way down to my cheekbone and all the way up to my temples. I really should have tied my hair up for this. Good thinking, Sarah. So I just pat it in really gently until it's all absorbed. Okay. And I do that in the morning and I do it at night. Now at night time, um, I'll pop my Midnight Recovery Concentrate right over that. This is such an incredible product. I have done some reviews on it, so I'll pop those down below. But I just wanted to mention this, um, even though we are doing morning skincare routines today, I wanted to mention um, this product because it is that good. So, back to the morning. After I've applied my eye cream, I start to go in with the Clearly Corrective Dark Spot Solution. Now, I'm very lucky, I don't have a lot of pigmentation on my face, but I do have a few little freckles on my nose and a little bit on the tops of my cheeks. And I've also been using it on the palms of my hands because I have a lot of, well not a lot, but I have a little bit of pigmentation there from driving. So what I do, it's quite, um, it's very liquidy, but it's almost a thick liquid if I can put it that way. So I just few drops in my fingers, there we go, I rub it together and then I again I just press it on. I really like to press my um, serums on, I find that it applies better and also wherever I can I try not to pull and tug at the skin. So we just press it in until it's nice and absorbed. Right now that that's on I go in with the powerful strength line reducing concentrate. Again, I don't have huge lines and wrinkles on my face just yet, so I've been using it as a preventative treatment on my neck. So let me just get this mop of hair out the way. I love the texture. It comes out as like a cream, but then it almost goes velvety on your fingertips. It's so nice. Remember, always upward motions on your neck. You don't want to pull anything down. You want to lift everything up. Right, now that that's on, then I go in with my Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. I really enjoy this moisturizer, and I'm very fussy about my moisturizers. Sometimes they feel too heavy, sometimes they're too light, and they don't give me enough moisture, but I feel this one is just perfect. It's a very light moisturizer, but it still gives me all the moisture I need. My skin feels so nice and hydrated. So again, we just press that on a bit. And again, you really need such a small amount. I've really been impressed about how far... Um, the Kiehl's products go. A little bit really goes a long way. And on your neck. Yes. 
and they absorb quite quickly as well, which is great. Okay, and then last but not least, I pop on the Kiehl's Actively Correcting BB Cream. So I wasn't sent this one, I've had it for a little while, but I wanted to show it in this video as well because it's such a nice BB cream and I love the fact that it's SPF 50, which is such a plus. Especially when you're using stuff for pigmentation, you should always be using an SPF. That's that. That is my morning routine at the moment. It's really quick. Um, it's really easy, but I know that my skin's getting everything that it needs, which is so great. Um, I love the fact my skin doesn't look oily. It just looks natural and glowy and healthy. And um, literally, if I'm not going anywhere, Lani, for the day, I pop on a bit of mascara, maybe a little bit of lip, and that's it. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. I have loads of videos coming, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.